Hey there, I'm Michael Bovey with Consumer Recovery Network. Thanks for tuning in to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to talk about what to do when you're struggling to keep up with payments with your Best Egg loan. Um, Best Egg is a marketplace lender, kind of like a lending club or an upstart or an upgrade, right? So they're kind of a lending platform, a servicer. It's usually somebody else that is the money behind the loans, like a bank or you know some, some deep pockets. And the loan balances can get pretty high. Uh, I think they loan up to like 35,000. So what I've found in, since Best Egg existed, I've been helping people with debt problems for 25 years. Um, from, from the outset with Best Egg, it's never just a Best Egg. It's usually that loan and then some credit cards or even other marketplace lenders, you know, personal loans that you're trying to contend with. It could be the case that you have some smaller balance credit cards and it's the best egg that's really you're struggling with because you're running out of money before you run out of months and it's that big, big payment that you're, you're struggling with. And if that's the case, or really if you just have the one loan, like it's not very common, but maybe you just have a best egg loan and that's the only debt, then it's gonna be, this video is gonna be pretty straightforward and helpful for you. So when you're in a situation where you haven't really, they haven't shown up as 30 days late on your credit report yet. Best egg isn't showing as a negative and you haven't talked to them yet and tried to get some kind of plan or reduc reduced monthly payment from them. Um, call them. And this is the case with just about, about any lender. If you're not so far gone with your payments that, you know, they're not going to unring that credit damage, call them, talk to them, find out what's on the table. It's, um, you know, it didn't, Best Egg didn't start out offering a lot of concessions or ways to keep you current by reducing your payment or reducing your interest, but they're doing that now. So if you um, have had a Best Egg loan in the past and they have been inflexible and you just found a way to keep current, um, you might hear something different from them today. And if you don't, they are working with the nonprofit credit counseling agencies around the country. So some of these other personal loan platforms, they absolutely will not give you any benefit when working with one of the nonprofit credit counseling agencies where all the brick and mortar banks work with those, right? They even refer you to them. If you can't afford your credit cards, your credit card's 23%, get your interest rate reduced down to say 5%, 6%, and suddenly now your monthly payment's affordable. So you can call Best Egg and see what they can do for you directly without having to go through any third party. They will communicate openly to, from my experience and the people that make those calls and give me their feedback um, that it's, it's a fairly painless process. I mean, it's math. You can either do something or you can't. If they're going to give you enough of a concession that you feel you can make a go of it and not have to fall late and screw up your credit, go for it. If that, however they're going to work with you and reduce your payment is only temporary and you need more than temporary help, that's an issue. You don't want to commit to something that you're not confident you can follow through on. If it's not long-term hardship payments, then go talk to one of the nonprofits, right? You can, you can call the number on the screen, 800-939-8357. You'll hear my voice go through a call tree and our menu of options. Just press one. That's going to connect you live to a nonprofit consumer credit counselor who can give you, hopefully in that one call, usually, if you have answers to their questions, most of us do, a quote, exact to the penny quote of what they can get your best egg payments down to. Bonus, they can also talk to you about other debts that you have. You're not committing yourself to anything. You're just getting information and getting a quote. So if you can't afford your best egg payment because of other debts too, what if those became suddenly more affordable to you? It's a phone call away just you know to get that estimate. I like to tell people to sleep on that information if you're not on fire and fire would include, you know, you're being sued for a uh, unpaid debt. So take the time, get the information, get the quote, sleep on it for a day, a week. You'll know if it's something you can do, do the math, commit to things that you know you can follow through on. So if your situation's so far gone that you're not going to be able to pay Best Egg or other creditors, maybe you haven't paid and there's really nothing for it. You don't have the money and you can't put together a plan. I usually skip, I go, I start with the nonprofit credit counseling, can I afford X and not hurt my credit? Okay, no. Then skip what I'm mostly known for, which is helping people settle debt all these 25 years. And let's look at whether or not you qualify for chapter seven. Why do I go there instead of settlement? Well, 
Chapter seven is a fresh start and best egg loans are usually pretty high. They're big, big balances. And so the idea of coming up with a lot of cash in a shorter window of time for a settlement, it's, it's not always an option. And if you qualify for chapter seven, which you do have to qualify, it's based on your last six months of income, whatever state you live in, how many people in your household, those numbers can move. And if, if you can do it and the national average cost is less than two grand for chapter seven and get a fresh start and rebuild your credit sooner than it would take you to even settle the debt, well, then I like that for you, right? Debt settlement, it's um, really an alternative to chapter 13. And so not everybody gets to qualify for chapter seven. You're not gonna be able to discharge your best egg loan in a chapter seven and you'd be forced into a chapter 13. Debt settlement's gonna typically be, uh, for a lot of people, at least in my work experience, a better option. So what does that mean? Well, so lenders, everybody, Best Egg, all the banks, all the personal loan lenders, anybody that loans money for a living knows that not everybody's going to be able to pay them back. The more you loan, the more accounts you have, the more that number is just, it's baked into the cake. So they have policies and procedures to deal with people that can't pay. And settlement's an option. So assume for a moment, I, I can get into the details of your situation more on a brief phone call. By the way, I do talk to people on the phone. It is me. When you schedule in the link in the description, there's a link to schedule with Michael, right? And or if you call that same toll-free number and press two, you're going to connect to me as well. So when I talk with people, we offer to get help people lower their payments or settle debt for a fraction of the cost of what any other company really charges across the country. We always have. Um, the thing is, is I don't lead with that. I lead with, well, let's see if we can preserve your credit. Let's see if you can get more relief from bank bankruptcy. But if we help you and you want our help and you're not just going to do it yourself, then we have a fee for it, but it's half the cost of everybody else. Sometimes I just have one of those free phone calls with somebody and in five minutes I can point something out to them strategically that that's all they needed. And there's no charge for that, right? So scheduling time with me to go over your situation and really project what your best egg settlement's going to be is it's real simple. Um, what they tend to settle for, let's just assume for right now, on a basic video is around half, okay? There are nuanced things that make people be able to settle for lower or even worse than 50%. But 50% is a good benchmark for the math we're gonna do today. So assume for a moment that you don't have any other debt to worry about, you're just dealing with this monster best egg loan and you can settle for half. And now, what if you can spend, you know, I have that half. If I had that half, Michael, I wouldn't need to be watching your video. Um, it's not like you need that half. You can actually do settlements and spread them out over time. Two years is pretty common. It's not necessarily a best egg settlement that you'll get, but it could be with a debt collector that best egg sends it to. And so here is where some of the nuance comes in. We all have different scores as far as collectability goes. If you're paying a mortgage and a car loan and your student loans and five credit cards on time, just not this best egg loan, you look like somebody who's keeping a bunch of plates in the air, have regular income. You look more collectible. Your settlement probably won't be as good in that instance. Sometimes the amount of time that you get to pay a settlement in certain situations is longer than your neighbor, right? Or somebody else I'm working with. And it is it's individualized, right? So don't assume that you won't be able to afford a settlement uh, if, if you break it out over enough time. Say it's a $20,000 best egg loan and you settle it for 10K and you get 24 or 36 months to pay that and you can be successful with that and still manage all of your other debt. It's going to make sense typically more than a chapter 13. So you have options. You start by communicating with your creditor in this instance, best egg find out how they can work with you, exhaust any and all of those options. You can work with a nonprofit agency, call the number on the screen, press one, get that quote. And then if you want to speak with me and I can just walk you through, well, this is what settlement would look like for you, or here's some things that maybe will help you prevent having to do this or any of it. Because sometimes I'm thinking of things that you're not thinking of because you're just under a lot of stress and a lot of pressure. And I can distill that down and seriously, five or 10 minutes. So I look forward to speaking with you if I get the chance to and seeing you on the next video.